What's up, YouTube? Here are shoes. And I got lucky, even though they seem like they did sell out eventually. It took a little while, but I got a pair at finish line. There you go. Air Jordan 11 Retro. You can see that metallic on the box. Size eight and a half. Black, gym red, white, and anthracite. 378-037-002-220. Uh, finish line gave me, <laughs> so I got below retail, so they gave me 20 bucks. Uh, just to spend it, he just gave me a random $20. I didn't even purchase anything recently. So I took the $20 and it worked $20 off that. So I got a below $20 retail. That was dope. And I never, first time I ever had uh, Jordan 11 highs. Nice box with that red, the ring right there, real nice. It's like a candy apple. And uh, so I got lucky. I remember years ago when the Concords came out. I had them in my car. It looked like I could purchase them. And I was like, I'll wait till later. So as soon as I came back later, they were gone. So I never did that again. If I ever got a chance to purchase them, I purchased them instantly. Let's see if I got lucky. Anyway, here's that box. With the 23 on it. Look like it has the metallic. They say speckles. I say it's like a metallic. Like a car paint job. You got that. Jordan. Right there. Logo the same that's on the shoe. Jordan Jumpman. All right, let's open the box. Oh, here's the bottom. Metallic. I think metallic's pretty dope because it's more of a car paint job. You know, it's distinct. It's really not as noticeable. It's like the big flakes, like a big kindergarten flakes. <laughs> the little kids' shoe flakes. <laughs> right, let's open them up. Check them out, check them out. Oh, yes. I was so happy. I opened the box and made a video, but I kept it for myself because uh, <laughs> I was like a little kid. Here goes that. Then I have words on it. Tinker made them shine, of course. Mike made them fly. You made them iconic. Oh, I got 11s before, but the lows. I had a plain light, the Concord lows, the cherry, cherry lows, those lifestyle ones. That, oh yeah, it does look like carpet fiber. That's on the bottom of the shoe. Padded, seriously padded. Let's take the shoe out. Okay. Let's put this back on. Here. I know everybody's seen plenty of videos, but I just show them on. It's my hobby. Just excited that I got up here. So I thought I might show everybody. Everybody's probably tired of seeing them already, though. I'm not. And I like the YouTube videos. I go through YouTube just to see uh, authenticity, you know, how think they are, all the people's pair, comparisons, who got them, you know. I go through YouTube. Even when I purchase used shoes, I like to see if they're real or from like different sites. See, you know, how legit they are. You can compare them a lot of videos. So YouTube is awesome. And that's why I like to list mine too. Cause I go through a lot of videos just to see. I go watch more than one to see how authentic they are. Let's take a 360. Love these man. Only problem I wear it's eight and a half, nine, it depends, but these might be a little but I don't care. I'll squeeze my foot in there if it's too tight. Alright, let's check them on. The patent leather top. The metallic. Look at that, all that blings. Bling bling. That's nice. All the way around the upper. box and that I think this is dope that they put the tumble leather on top instead of that uh, canvas or nylon they put on top of that, that ballistic material whatever they call it 
I think that's dope, but this is raw. This is dope, super dope. Got that Jordan Jumpman with the red Jumpman. It's really nice. The tongue feels really nice too. A soft, it feels like a softer patent leather than the other. Like I have the fives, metallics are really, patent leather is nice on there, but it's more smooth. But still super dope. And I wonder how, if these will hold up. These look like a, <laughs> that, what'd you call it? Material. New book. You wouldn't think that might not hold up because like that nylon that they had on the original ones, the other 11s, that's durable as heck. You never seen anything break, but who knows if these will hold up. It looks pretty thick. We'll soon find out. And that embroidered 23 is dope. That's why they should have been doing that from Jump. <laughs> and that Jump Man too. It looks plastic. Look, look like it could be metal, but it's probably plastic. But that's super dope too. Instead of an embroidered one, I think that's raw they did that. That new book, uh, it's all right. This is like that stretchable material in the back. You got that carbon fiber. Red and black checkerboard is raw. That also. That Elmer's glue color. <laughs> that jump man on there. And the light looks like it's yelling a little bit already. It's kind of odd. The white bit so. You would think it would last longer because of the milkiness on the. the tint that it has on it but the traction pods herringbone traction pods let's see how the difference between these two are this one looks a little lighter than that one one looks a little more yellow than the other one these are finish lines too stripped out this looks a little wider Elmer's glue. Now you put the Elmer's glue on your fingers and then you peel it off. That's what it looks like. Alright, let's pop one of these cardboards up. Oh, they smell good though. You got that jump man in there. Eight and a half. They could have did a little better though. Put some metal eyelets. These are 72. It's supposed to be 72 and 10. There goes the 10. And then this. They want to come out. There goes that, in, that shoe tree metallic. I have to have time to get them out and do it later. They're pretty much in there, pretty good. I <laughs> lose them up, anyways. That's ridiculous. Put this back in there. They said they had problems with them turning yellow already. That's because we were sitting. What's the date on these? Everybody's talking about if somebody gets an early release. They've been made for months, though. Let's see, let's see the year, the date. I can't get it. It's way in there. Looks like this is July. <laughs> 2015, so they've been made for months and months. And they made a lot of them. And everybody was saturated with them. And they still sold out. It took a minute, but they sold out. I got mine, but barely. These are dope, though. I'm excited about them. See, you can see the two different... Look like that one's yelling a little bit in this one. That's crazy. I wonder if they both have the same date on the shoe. <laughs> That'd be odd if they had two different dates. That one looks just about the same, but from me looking at it personally. 
It's a trip. Like you have to wear them right away. Super dope though. There you go. It was my babies. Love these. With mine, if I can get another pair. But they're basically sold out. The sixes too. I got two pairs of sixes. Bruins are sitting. Those are one of the best between those and these. I don't know. Those sixes are super dope. Love the sixes, but first time for me to get the highs. Dope. Alright, to the next. Tell me what you think. Peace.